I would love to say I look like the happy humanist, who's a wonderful little black and white guy with his little hands up in the air, and he's really happy, because I think because he is a humanist. I've been a humanist all my life, which has been quite a long time. And I, I never had a name for it when I was a kid. I, I just knew that I didn't believe in in beings and people and devils and angels that you can't see anywhere regulating my life and maybe punishing me at the end of my life because I haven't been a good girl. And I felt sort of ashamed of it for a long time because everybody went to church and dressed up for it and really seemed to believe very devoutly in, in uh, supernatural beings such as God and um, the angels and Jesus actually lived, so he was not supernatural. I, I do believe in him, but he, he may have been a humanist too. He was liberal enough to do that. Once I grew up, I realized that a humanist was what I, what I am, and um, I no longer hide it. I've moved to a wonderful church in Lakeland, Florida, uh, the Unitarian Universalist Congregation of Lakeland, where I know I don't have to hide the fact that I'm a humanist because there are a lot of other humanists here with me and we have a very nice life together. Thank you.